when you see that girl with a messed up past putting on a hijab and praying in Ramadan, that isn't trying to act holy. That's the essence of Iman. When you see people taking the Quran off that dusty shelf and reciting it for the first time in the year, that isn't being typical. That's a testification of the beauty that lives within their souls because they're trying. And when you see mosques which are empty all year round fill up during the blessed month, that's not hypocrisy. That's a sign that truth still exists within the community and there is genuine hope. Perhaps this year a single action of that person you label as a Ramadan Muslim will surpass all of the worship and good deeds that you spent a lifetime doing. We all had a moment in life when things clicked and we were blessed with guidance. And if Allah can forgive prostitutes, mass murderers and thieves and give them Jannah due to sincerity, then you think that girl without jilbab, the brother without tajweed or those men without beards, those guys who didn't pray and the Ramadan Muslims can't be forgiven and given guidance due to sincerity as well? The Prophet ﷺ, he said, Bashira wala tunafira. Give glad tidings of hope and don't repel people away. Our Prophet came to give hope to those who were lost. Don't you dare ever stand in the way of someone trying to get closer to Allah. Because who knows if we will enter paradise or the hellfire. So give people hope. It's all we truly have.